I'm Dwayne Ross of Servants United Parish. I will be leading daily devotions with you. The basis for these daily devotions is from Christ in Her Home, a daily devotional series. The Bible readings are from the Revised Standard Version. For Saturday, June 17th, our scripture is from the 5th chapter of Romans, verses 1 through 8. Therefore, we, since we are justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ, through whom we have obtained access to this grace in which we stand. And we, have, and we boast in our hope of sharing the glory of God. And not only that, but we also boast in our suffering, knowing that suffering produces endurance. And endurance produces character, and character produces hope. And hope does not disappoint us, because God's love has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit that has been given to us. For while we were still weak, at the right time Christ died for the ungodly. Indeed, rarely will anyone die for a righteous person. Though perhaps for a good re- good person, someone might already dare to, might actually dare to die. But God proves his love for us in that while we were still sinners, God, Christ died for us. Precious hope. He does not disappoint us because God's love has been poured into our hearts. Verse 5. On December 1st, 2005, a normal day ended in tragedy. At my seventh, seven-month pregnancy appointment, no heartbeat was detected distraught, my husband and I began our painful trek to the maternity ward where I would labor all night to give birth to a child I knew was already dead. Until that moment I considered giving our considered naming our baby Ebony Hope. But something would not allow me to lay hope in a grave. Perhaps it was John, James Weldon Johnson's words in the hymn lift every voice and sing stony the road we trod bitter the chastening rod fell in the days when hope unborn had died in that silent delivery room I needed hope not just any hope but hope that would not disappoint hope that comes from God through the Holy Spirit this hope was too precious to bury We named our baby Joy, inspired by Psalm 30, verse 5. Weeping may linger for the night, but joy comes with the morning. Hope lives, and joy will be resurrected. Our prayer. Faithful God, thank you for granting us your hope that sustains us through the heartbreak. Amen. Please join me in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen.